I'm very excited for the year ahead. This will change my world. I'm ready to feel like a woman again, and I think it's been um, a long time coming. Now I'd like you to meet a woman who wants to be her whole self again. Welcome Giselle Tanous from Sydney. Have a seat. Giselle, what is it you'd like to do in the next year? This time next year, I will have beautiful new boobs. <laughs> Tell us your story. So, about a year and a half ago, I was diagnosed with breast cancer. Um, my daughter was seven months old, and I was 19 weeks pregnant with my son. Boy, oh boy. That's terrible. I'm sorry, darling. Sorry, it still gets me. Yeah. Um, so, I underwent chemotherapy while I was pregnant. Um, went on to have a double mastectomy, mm. um, which is why at the moment I wear um, these little prosthetics. Um, so I tuck them in my bra to mm. look like I have boobs. Um, and they are very uncomfortable to wear. Are they? Very um, heavy. They're just not ideal. Undergoing chemotherapy, that in itself is difficult, let alone pregnancy and the yeah. complications of it. I had four rounds of just, it was a low dose chemo. You know, there's times where I wanted to give up and I just didn't want to get out of bed. Yeah. Don't want to do it anymore. Um, and I would just feel a little kick. You know, and he just told me to fight for him. Oh. Tell me, though, when that little man came. Yeah. Tell me about that. Oh, it was just the perfect day. You know, he, he was born and I just... I just said to myself, I did it. I fought through it and he fought through it with me. Tough boy with a tough mum. Yep. After you um, give birth, what happened? Yeah, I went through another round of treatment. Um, I had the full dose of it. Are you in the clear now? I'm in remission, yes. Wow. Had the all clear. Good on you. <laughs> What's your little boy's name? Noah. Hi, Noah. <laughs> what a beauty. Uh, I'm talking about the, the baby, not your husband. Is that your husband there as <laughs> yes, well? Yes, What a specimen he is. <laughs> Joseph, what about your wife? The strength. Oh, she's, she's a soldier. She's Wonder Woman to me. How much do you love her? If my arms could stretch, it would circle the world twice, at least, Aww. minimum. That is a beautiful thing to say. <laughs> I need to write that down and put it on a card. <laughs> so what steps do you need to take here? I'm going to have some reconstruction surgery. Um, so they take the fat and the skin and the muscles and everything from your stomach and they create boobs. Um, <clears throat> very risky operation. Is it? Yeah. Why? Um, so they're using your own skin, your own fat, your own veins, they're connecting veins. Um, mm. So there's a lot of risks involved. It's a very long surgery. Is it, is it a big recovery given the complications with surgery? Given nothing goes wrong, um, it's about a six to eight week recovery. Yeah. Um, could be infections involved. Depends on how my body takes it. Have you discussed with um, handsome and very large husband, Joseph, <laughs> um, what sort of breasts that you... you, 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 you might... oh, this is all good. You know, I'm just treading the fine line here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> um, that you might... <laughs> anyway. Well, I want some perky ones. Perky. That'd be nice. <laughs> and, and Joseph, that's... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what a legend. I'm very excited for my new body. I just want to feel that womanly, you know, feel like a woman again and feel like I have the confidence to put on a sexy dress and, and go to a party or, you know, yeah. um, bra shopping, just the simple things. Do you reckon you deserve it? Yes, I do. God damn it. I do. I deserve <laughs> this. <laughs> so this time next year, I will have beautiful new boobs. All right.
I'm here to see my breast surgeon today to plan for surgery. It's the first start for me to get my new boobs. <laughs> we're going to take this segment of muscle and we're going to transfer it up into here. What we're doing for Giselle is we're going to do a tummy tuck and we're taking the skin and fat and we're going to take that up into the chest to make two new breasts. It's important for me to give Giselle her femininity back. Your new breasts are going to feel soft and that's a major distinction from people yeah. that go down the implant path. It's hit me that it's actually happening, so I'm really excited to feel like a beautiful mum again. Feeling excited, nervous, anxious, a lot of feelings. Doing a breast reconstruction using a patient's own tissue is complicated surgery. The recovery from this is fairly substantial. She needs to take a bit of time off from being a mum, but this is Giselle's best option. I can't wait to just look in the mirror and go, wow, like, I've fought a battle and I came out the other end and feel beautiful about it too. Last year, I made a pledge to have amazing new boobs. Making this promise was important to me. I just wanted to look in the mirror and love how I felt. Giselle wanted her breast reconstruction to help reclaim her life. Let's welcome her back. You look so beautiful. Thank you. You feel it? I feel beautiful. Do you? Yes. What was your pledge? That I'm going to have amazing boobs. <laughs> and I think they look amazing for where I'm looking. <laughs> you were after a certain style of boobs? Perky. Perk, yes. <laughs> um, achieved? Tick? I think so. Yeah? Yeah. Um, <laughs> It's made me so much happier, confident, had a really good summer and a nice costume. Did you? Yeah. Oh, how nice. So it's been good. Joseph, how did it all go? It went well. Well, besides the recovery. Oh. Yeah, the recovery was hard. Mm. But at the end of the day, look at her, she's glowing. When you look in the mirror, how does it feel? I feel like I love the person that I see again. And it's important for me, you know, for my daughter as well, to for look sure. up to me and I look at me like, you know, I look like every other woman. Has this completed you? It has. I've just, I am just feel like I'm a different person. I can get on with life, make up time with my kids that I've lost during this ugly process, mm. and um, just enjoy life, mm. cancer free. Can I say something to you having the courage in the aftermath of double mastectomy, which is brutal, is quite extraordinary. Thank you. We are over the moon for you, um, you and Joseph, uh, what, a, what a lovely man you are. Um, <laughs> uh, enjoy those days at the beach and enjoy just, just having some normal life. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you.